hello guys welcome to my channel you are watching how to fix tech friends in this video i am going to show you how to fix this error window cannot access and now you can see the error code of this error it is 0 into 8007035 the network path not found this is the error we are going to fix this error first we need to check that the ip address and the share folder address we are going to connect is shareable or not let's find out that now cancel this i will show you five steps to resolve this issue starting from basic to advanced now first we need to follow the basic steps we need to confirm that the share folder which we want to connect is shareable or not let's take an example of this folder like this i have made this folder named share folder right click on it go to properties first and then go to sharing tab here now make sure it is shared like this you can see the network path here if you found here not share then what you can do you need to click on advanced options here first and you need to check this box share this folder and the share name you can uh, write down here now click on apply and you can also define the permissions from here like this i'm going to give full control and make sure everyone is added here how you can add this like this check name eva for everyone and now you can see everyone is added click on ok and give the full permissions now apply then ok and this as well apply ok and close this now you need to make sure you are using right path like press window plus r button together and then use this slash and then ip address of the system and then press slash this as well and then the location of the drive like this you can see this is the complete path of the network and make sure you are using the network path and hit ok and then the shareable folder should be appeared if this is not going to help we have another fix for you in second method we are going to change network security setting sometimes security is enabled that's why you are not able to access the share folder for that press window plus r button together like this and type here secpol dot msc like this and this is the security path and this is the security setting which sometimes conflict to not share the folder or not access the folder you are not able to access the folder because of the network security options here now you need to double click on local policies like this the expand the third option which is security options double click on it and now you will see bunch of options here now you need to scroll down and come to network security this is you need to find network security lan manager authentication label it is not defined right now double click on it you can see the way like this and now you can see the drop down menu here you need to choose second option which is send lms and nt lms use lt session security if negotiated choose this option hit apply and then ok now you can see we have defined the security setting here this one session security if negotiated now close this and now your problem should be fixed we have changed some setting now if this second step did not work for you we have third method we are going to reset or reconfigure tcp ip sometime misconfiguration or conflict may cause this issue so we are going to reset this for that you need to right click on connected network go to open network and internet settings 
you will see options like this you need to scroll down and click on change adopter options now you need to click on the connected network if uh, you have connected with wi-fi or ethernet you need to select that and right click on it go to properties make sure the first option is selected client for microsoft network click on install here and then choose the third option which is protocol this one click on add after clicking on protocol you should be getting the option reliable multicast protocol click on that option and hit ok and ok now your issue should be fixed we have reset the network and tcp and reinstall it and check your issue should be fixed if this method did not work for you we have another fix for you in fourth method we are going to enable network discovery which is used for share any documents on the network for enabling that you need to go to control panel make sure the small icon should be chosen here like this now you need to click on network and sharing center here click on that you will see options like this you need to click on change advanced sharing settings clicking on advanced sharing settings you need to go to private expand this option and now you need to choose first option turn on network discovery click on this make sure it is uh, take turn on automatic setup of network connected devices click on save changes now again go to change advanced sharing settings and this time expand guest or public current profile and make sure the turn on the discovery should be chosen the way i have chosen here like this save changes close this now go to all networks expand this option make sure first option is chosen turn on sharing so anyone with network access can read and write files in the public folder click on this option and scroll it down use this option use 128 bit encryption to help protection filing sharing center recommended choose this option and you need to choose this option turn off password protected sharing now after choosing of these options the way i have chosen and demonstrated you click on save changes and now your file should be shareable uh, because we have enabled the network discovery from here now close this option and check the your issue should be fixed and try to connect with the folder in fifth method we are going to enable the net bios helper service which is responsible for sharing the folders first we need to check which service should be enabled for confirming that you need to press window plus r button together and write here services dot msc like this press ok go to tcp ip net bios helper press t now you can see this option tcp ip net bios helper make sure its status should be running if not then double click on it this and startup type should be automatic here like this if the service status is stopped you need to click on start button here let me show you like this click on start button after choosing automatic then hit apply and then okay now you need to restart your system your issue should be fixed now if your issue is not fixed then you can comment me i will try to reply you if your issue is solved then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech